Hi Virgo, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Virgo, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Virgo. So at the bottom of the deck, we have the two of wands, and this is fire energy, Sagittarius, Aries, Leo energy. So this is a planning energy. This is an energy of somebody who is looking at, um, you know, the, the potential, uh, where things could go, what opportunities could be made available for this connection. So I do see this as someone who's, you know, wanting to see the next steps of the connection. This is somebody who wants to see the possibilities. Um, this is someone who is trying to think ahead long term. Um, you could be connecting here with somebody who is um, of a different background or there could be travel involved in some way. So let's see what the rest of the cards have to say about this um, Virgo. Okay, so the first card we have is the Three of Pentacles and this is Earth Energy. Next, you have the Four of Wands, Fire Energy. And finally, we have the Knight of Swords, Air Energy. So definitely this person wants to move this connection forward. We are seeing someone who is, but it's like they want to be practical about it because we also have this Three of Pentacles, which is a, a practical energy. Um, it's an energy of building a proper foundation, um, doing things carefully. So this person may be wanting to make plans for this, the future of this connection. There is a certain milestone that this person is um, wanting to achieve for this connection. They are ready to take the next step. They they want this connection to um, reach this four of wands energy which is a wish a wish being granted this is that 11 11 energy this is union um, a union moving up and level so to the next step this could be moving in together for some this could even be marriage this is just that next step um, to um, solidify this connection achieving some sort of structure and stability for this union and with the three of pentacles this is somebody who sees long-term potential in this connection they see it as a connection that really works well they feel like you guys are compatible and that you guys make a great team and uh, i do see them you know it's like they're going from being in the planning stages to having made their mind up so there's something that this person is becoming clear on becoming decisive and even determined on so this person is making some sort of efforts or action towards um achieving a four of wands outcome with you so let's clarify these cards um virgo Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Wheel of Fortune, and this is fixed sign energy, Taurus, Leo, Aquarius, Scorpio energy. So this is, again, a very divine energy. This is divine timing as well. Uh, I do see this person is going to surprise you, or they're planning something big towards you, but something very, it's, it's going to make you happy because we do have that four of wands, but it's almost like it's 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 meant to be a surprise or it's unexpected, um, but it's definitely something that's going to change the dynamic of this union uh, for the better, of course. So let's see what the rest of the cards have to say about this um, Virgo. Okay, so the first card we have is the Two of Cups, and this is Water Energy. Next, we have the Six of Wands, Fire Energy. 
And finally, we have the star card, Aquarius energy. So you could be dealing with an Aquarius. So this person really does see you as their person. They see you as their partner. They see you as someone they have an emotional connection with. And um, there's very compatible energy. This person has so much love for you. And I am seeing a grand gesture with that six of wands. It's like, this person is going to be doing something that is quite um, special for this connection and it is leveling up the connection. This is someone who, again, we see them, they have a future. They see a future with you, with the star card. Um, they, they want to do something quite unique, something special for you, and they're going to go out of their way for you. I do see this person is making plans to do something quite romantic and significant, um, and it's going to lead to some sort of milestone for this connection. Um, so with the Six of Wands, this could also be people being around and seeing this. Um, family with this Four of Wands, family, friends, loved ones could be um, witnessing this, um, or they could be hearing about this or seeing this, and as a result, it's like they're celebrating the union it's like there's people cheering this connection on and um some sort of recognition for this union um this could be you guys making this connection more official becoming committed um this could be marriage with the four of wands it could even just be moving in together whatever that next step is but it's something that is solidifying or making the connection that much more official and this person has planned this they've been thinking about this they've you know been pl making plans and i do see them actually implementing this okay so i'm going to pull out an oracle card for you um virgo Card says a fiery climax approaches full moon in aries okay so i see this is a union that will soon be having a reason to celebrate there's something here that is about to happen that is going to be uh very joyful and worth celebrating for this connection okay so i'm going to pull out another card for you um virgo So the card says, keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. So I see this keep an open mind thing as uh, this person is going to do something unexpected. Um, also with the star card, it's like the Aquarius energy. This person, they've got something planned here, but it's definitely something that's going to make you happy. It's it's definitely a positive surprise or, um, you know, they, they're going to do something very unexpected, um, but it's going. It's almost like a celebration of some sort. Um, it could be some sort of gift or a gesture. Is what I'm seeing. Um, it, it's like they'll be celebrating you and the union they have with you. Okay, so I'm going to pull out another card for you, um, Virgo. So the card says, Lilac, first emotions of love. Love is the magician that pulls man out of his own hat. Okay, so I do see this person is going to pleasantly surprise you. Okay, so um, since we are also in Virgo season and we have this four of wands, they could do something special for you on your birthday. Or they just, I, I see someone who has plans to do something very special for you. And it's going to level up the connection or the bond that you have with them. Okay, so this is definitely somebody who sees you as their future. They see you as someone that they adore, somebody that they have a strong connection with. And um, they have a lot of love for. And they, I, I do see them reigniting the first emotions of love those feelings that you have almost like um you know the feelings you get at the honeymoon stage of a connection there's something this person is doing to revive those feelings okay so that's what i'm feeling i'm seeing for you virgo i hope you have a really really good day virgo bye virgo